This is your time. This is your season. And this is your moment. Welcome to another edition of This is your time. This is your season. This is your moment. This is Dr. Tommy Campbell, Jr. I want to let you know you are destined for greatness. You are going to accomplish your dreams. You may be going through right now. You may be at rock bottom. You may have a lot of problems. You may be depressed. You may be dealing with different life issues. Well, maybe, well, maybe your life is okay right now. Maybe everything is going great. I want to tell you, you may be, you may be out of the storm. But there are people who are on their way in a storm, and there, there, there are people that are on their way out of a storm, and there are people who are already in the storm. I want to talk to those people who are in the storm. If you're going through, if you're depressed, if you're grieving, if you're sick with cancer, if you're sick, if you're depressed, if you're in a bad relationship, if you're going through, if you are, if you are embarrassed about your past, if you are dealing with anything, I want to tell you that there is hope for you. You are going to make it through this. You are going to come out of this. You are going to achieve it. You're going to be it. You're going to do it. And you are going to accomplish it. Come on, let's do our mental exercise. Come on, get it in your mind. Get it in your mind right now while, while you're watching this motivational video. I want you to get it in your mind right now. Whatever you want to do, whatever you want to be, whatever you want to become, get it within your mind right now. And then once you get it in your mind, I want you to see yourself accomplishing what you want to be. See yourself accomplishing what you want to become. And then start decreeing it and declaring it. Start speaking it. Say, I am going to win the Super Bowl. Say, I am going to win the NBA championship. Say, I am going to win the NCAA championship. Say, I am going to win the World Series. Say, I will be a billionaire. Say, I will be a multi-millionaire. Say, I will find my soulmate. Say, I will start that business. Say, I will be the CEO of that company. Say, I will get in college. Say, I will pass that GED. Say, I will get that academic scholarship. Say, I will be a teacher, nurse, lawyer, surgeon, doctor. Doctor, lawyer, movie producer, singer, actor, published author, motivational speaker. I don't know what you want to do. But today, today's message is going to be special. I want to take my time. I want to take my time today and I want to teach you. And the reason why I want to teach you, because this motivational video today, it is going to be epic. It is going to be powerful. It is going to be inspiring. It's going to give you courage. And most of all, this motivational video today is going to empower you. I am in London. I am in Australia. I am in Canada. I am in Bermuda. I am in the NBA. I am in the NFL. I am in corporate. Why? Because I believe in myself and I'm ready for the moment. Let me tell you something. This brings me to my first point. If you're going to be great, if you grind now, I want to teach you. I want to go slow today. I want to teach you. If you grind now, you will shine later. Woo, plain and simple. I think I need to say that again. If you grind now, you will shine later. If you put in blood, sweat, tears, if you put in 120% now, you're going to shine later. If you are going to be great and successful, you must stay disciplined and stay focused. I'm going to say that again. If you are going to be great and successful, you are going to have to be disciplined and number two, you're going to have to stay focused. Feed your focus. Don't feed your fears. Don't feed procrastination. Don't feed doubt. Don't feed rejection. Don't feed negativity. But feed your focus. Feed positivity. Feed health. Feed wealth. Feed positivity. Why? Because today's motivational video is you are gifted. Just in case you didn't know, 
Just in case you didn't know, I want to tell you, you are gifted. And not only are you gifted, but you are gifted beyond measure. And I want to tell you this. If you want to take that corporation to the next level, I want you to learn everything you can about that company. Learn everything you can about that corporation. And I want you to I want you to learn everything about that corporation so you can take that company to the next level. You can be the CEO of that company. You can be an entrepreneur. You can be a business owner. You can sell real estate. You can be a real estate investor. You can be a teacher or a nurse or a doctor or a lawyer or a film producer, movie producer. You could be an actor. You could be a professional athlete. Whatever you want to do. Let me tell you something. You have gifts. The creator has given you gifts. There is gifts on the inside of you. There is purpose on the inside of you. There is destiny on the inside of you. And don't you let your issues, don't you let your problems, don't you let your mistakes. Let me tell you this. Don't focus on the problems. Don't feed your problems. Write that down. Stop feeding your problems. Stop putting all the in, in, stop putting all the emphasis on your problems. Stop putting all your energy into your problems and put your energy onto your solutions to the problems. Why? Because I want your mind to be free of resistance. I'm teaching. I want your mind to be free of resistance. I want your mind to be free of negativity. I want your mind to be free of procrastination. I want your mind to be free of fear. And I want you to become open to greatness. Become open to changing your way of thinking. Become open to developing a championship-like mentality. Warren Buffett, Mark Zuckerberg, uh, Bill Gates. Uh, Jeff Bezos, LeBron James, Tom Brady, Kevin Durant, Stephen Curry, Giannis, Chris Paul, Kyrie Irving. They all became great. Patrick Mahomes. They all became great because they embraced their failures. If you are going to be great, you're going to have to go through failure. Because anyone who has ever become successful, they will tell you that they went through failure. Failure is a part of the process and journey to greatness. I'm teaching today. I'm not as loud today. I'm teaching. Write this down. Opportunities are getting ready to surround you like never before. I'm telling you. Opportunities are getting ready to surround you like never before. So this brings me to my next point. You must be ready for the moment. Because there are so many people that they've all got gotten opportunities. But when the opportunities came to them, they were not ready for the opportunities. So they missed the opportunities. And let me tell you something. Everyone has always had an opportunity to be successful. Everyone. If you tell me I've never had a chance, I've never had opportunities to be great and successful, I will tell you that you are not telling the truth. But the opportunity came, but you were not ready for the moment. So this motivational video is going to help you get ready for the moment. I want you to get ready. I want you to let go of anything that will stop you from being ready for the moment. I want you to get rid of anything out of your life that will stop you from being ready to, to, that will stop you from being ready for the opportunity. Prepare yourself for the opportunity. So when the opportunity comes, you will be ready. You are gifted. I want you to believe in yourself and your ability to win in life. That's my next point. I want you to believe in yourself. And I want you to believe in yourself and your ability to win in life. You're going to win in life. You are a winner. You're not a loser. You may have lost a lot, but it doesn't mean you're a loser. You were created to win. You were not born to be average, but you were born to be phenomenal. You are phenomenal. You are great. You are amazing. You are beautiful. You are special. You are intelligent. You are amazing. You matter. You are phenomenal, and you are gifted beyond Measure. Don't be hindered. Next point. Don't be hindered or crippled 
by fear. Don't be hindered or crippled by fear, doubt, or insecurity. Stop being insecure. You have no reason to be insecure. You don't have to look at other people's success and look at other great people and you become insecure. Stop being insecure. Why? Because you need to look at them and say, if they can do it, then anything is possible. I went from flunking the first grade, being bullied in school, being labeled as retarded, had a reading and learning disability. I got in high school and I barely graduated high school. My high school teacher told me I wasn't smart enough to go to college. I wouldn't graduate high school. See, I had limitations put on me, but I did not receive those limitations. I took them. She said, you might as well go to the military. Mil go to the military. So I took the military test. Guess what? I flunked the military test. And I'm so glad that I failed the military test because it gave me an opportunity to prove my high school teacher wrong. So I got in college. But notice when I got in college, I got sick and I was hospitalized for a whole year. And I flunked out, but I didn't quit. I got back in on academic probation. And then in 2009, I became homeless, living on the streets. Then I was shot multiple times. Then I was pronounced dead in the hospital. And now I'm a motivational speaker and a published author of four motivational books. And I am a nominee for the Nobel Peace Prize Award. I, am, I have my doctoral degree. I'm a first generation college graduate student. Why? Because I believed in myself. Were there times I wanted to quit? There were times I wanted to quit. I almost quit, but there was something in me that would not let me quit. And I'm speaking to somebody right now. Maybe you're down. Maybe you're depressed. Maybe you're going through. Maybe you're insecure. Maybe you have low self-esteem. Maybe you are a billionaire. Maybe you are a multi-millionaire, but you're still not happy. Maybe your business is successful, but you're still not happy. You can find that joy. You can find that happiness. You can do. You can be anything you want to be because you are gifted. You have been created for a reason and a purpose. I'm closing. I, I want to save the best for last. You have been created for a reason and a purpose. There's a reason why you went through what you went through. Don't be ashamed of what you went through. Don't be ashamed of your pain. Don't be ashamed of your trouble. Don't be ashamed of your failures. Don't be ashamed of your rejection. Don't stay a prisoner. Stop being a prisoner of your past and use your past in a positive way to help somebody. All my failures, I'm using it to help people. You are destined for greatness. You matter. And you are gifted beyond measure. And now, I just published my fourth, I just published my fourth motivational book that's on Amazon. Go to Amazon and type in You Are Phenomenal. Doc, and type in Dr. Tommy Campbell Jr. This is my fourth motivational book. You are phenomenal. That's what I want to tell you. You are phenomenal and you are a champion. Maybe you've been telling you can write a book. You can accomplish your dreams. You can do anything. Let me tell you, anything is possible. I don't care how low you are right now. I don't care how depressed you are. You may be suicidal. You may be going through. You may, you may have lost your energy. You may not be as pumped up or as excited. You may put your dream down. Pick that dream back up. Dream again. Get your energy back. Get your life back. Because you're going to make it. You're going to win. You're going to achieve it. You're going to accomplish it. I know the pain is real. I know the pain is real. But you're going to make it through it. I made it through it. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Please spread the word about me all over social media as a social media as a motivational speaker. Please put positive comments. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. Share my videos. If you want to get in contact with me, my contact information is at the bottom of this email. I want to tell the whole world that I love you and I believe in you.